As we begin our first year as an independent island nation, I'm delighted to report on that rarest of creatures, a British technology company that's set to dominate its field and is already a fully-fledged unicorn. The company is called Graphcore, and they specialize in chips for high-performance applications like machine learning, artificial intelligence, driverless cars, and automated factories. The chips in our laptops, tablets, and smartphones simply aren't man enough for the job. And the combination of hardware and software tools that Graphcore has built for AI developers has caught the imagination of institutional investors who shunned the founders, Simon Knowles and Nigel Toon, when they first went looking for funding just four years ago. Despite their track record of having built a previous company and sold it to semiconductor maker NVIDIA for a cool $435 million, investors just didn't catch on to the potential of a new breed of superchip designed specifically for these resource-hungry artificial intelligence applications. They certainly get it now. The latest funding round has brought in $222 million, valuing the company at $2.8 billion. The chip is called Colossus in an ironic reference to the world's first all-electric programmable computer built at Bletchley Park just after the Second World War. The government decided to keep it a secret until the 1970s, so all the accolades went to the American ENIAC system, even though we Brits had been the first to crack the new technology. There's no secret this time. With backers like Bosch, Microsoft, Samsung, and Sequoia Capital, Graphcore looks set to dominate its sector and show that we can, after all, invent technology and fully exploit its commercial potential. All we need now is another 100 graph cores, and the impact of Brexit will be reduced to rounding factor.